Morning guys, so I just woke up and uh, I'm going to make some breakfast here um, and uh, I think I'm going to do pancakes today so I think I'll, I'll uh, do a little time lapse and uh, show you guys what I make um, but I always make my pancakes from scratch so uh, pretty simple, it's only 5 ingredients, a cup of flour, a teaspoon of baking soda, a cup of milk, an egg and uh, some vanilla extract about a a teaspoon um, and a little salt if you you want it but uh, super easy they turn out delicious and uh, yeah we'll uh, go from finished the pancake batter so as you can probably see you kind of want it like this nice and uh, kind of sticks to it but uh, it's kind of thick and you can always add a little more flour if you need to but yeah I'm gonna switch over to cooking it and uh, we'll see how see how far we get Final step, salt and pepper. And you can't pepper. Say it. Ouch! Well, my girlfriend's putting it on, but she doesn't want to be filmed right now because she, apparently she doesn't look presentable, but she does. So. Where's the other stuff? And there's the butter right over there, and there's the syrup. You gotta have syrup and a little salt and pepper on you the You don't eggs. have to have salt and pepper. You don't like salt and pepper on your eggs? No. What? What's wrong with you? You don't have to have syrup. You don't have... What? No syrup. But syrup is a standard. I guess... I don't, I don't, I don't always have syrup. Sometimes I like just yogurt on top. But I'm weird like that, so... Whatever. Anyways, I gotta stay out of the shot of her. Um, so I'm gonna have breakfast and then uh, go buy some batteries because you guys are dying, apparently. Um, but yeah, otherwise, uh, I will talk to you guys later. Did you just fart? <laughs> no. Oh. Oh, it must have just tasted good. She went, ah, and I was like, what? Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Oh. Well, hey guys, uh, sorry I haven't vlogged much today. It's, uh, been kind of a shitty day. I, uh, got a call pretty much right after making breakfast that, uh, one of my roommates wouldn't be able to live with me. 
next semester, um, not Adam, Adam's obviously moving out, but my other roommate, uh, Andrew Dobbs, and uh, he had found a place with a girlfriend, so I mean, I understand. Um, at the same time, it kind of sucks because I only have two weeks to find a, another guy before my landlord uh, is going to uh, start showing the house. So I've been uh, frantically making calls and stuff, and I don't know, it's just been kind of really stressful, so I've been kind of having a panicked day. Um, but, uh, you know, I'm doing what I can, and hopefully I won't have to move out of this place uh, next semester. I really enjoy it, and I have a lot there, so I don't want to have to move if I don't have to. Um, but yeah, so I'm doing that. Um, in a little bit, I'm going to be going down to the lacrosse center. It's like mid uh, It's almost like midnight. Um, so almost 24 hours from when I started vlogging this morning. Um, but yeah, so I've been uh, doing that most of the day, panicking most of the day. So um, it's kind of kind of been stressful. Um, but I uh, I think or I'm hoping it'll work out. It most likely will. If not, um, I, I guess I'll start looking for a new place. It'll be a venture for both of us. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'll be looking uh, for for what, I guess. I don't know. Like, I don't even know what I'm going to do with my stuff. So, yeah, sorry the lighting's really bad in here. I uh, It's kind of shitty. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, I'd love for you to hear you guys' uh, comments or, you know, maybe one of you that know me pretty well uh, could... Shoot me a message on Facebook or whatnot or anything like that. Uh, I'd love to hear uh, people's suggestions for this situation. Or um, I've never really looked for a place on my own before, so like websites or something like that that would be good for um, you know helping me find somewhere that would be nice. Um, I know obviously like the newspaper and stuff, but you know there's still there's still probably easier ways online to find a place uh, that would give you kind of a more accurate view on uh, what you're doing. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. So, thoughts on that. I've been uh, super stressed out, like I said, and uh, I'm going to do some dishes here before I go down there. I'm ground rigging down to the lacrosse center again. Uh, tonight, i got to put up 10 points with uh, some upriggers. Um, our previous video, I said that we basically put up the points. I'm on the ground, uh, like a ground rigger, which would kind of entail, I guess. Um, but, uh... There's upriggers as well. The upriggers are actually at the top, connecting the points up top. I'm at the bottom, making sure when the chain goes up in the air and uh, it doesn't fall on anyone or it's attached properly, um, and then uh, making sure that they have all the gear going up with it that they need to make sure the points are good and uh, contact. Um, hopefully, this this one turns out a little better. We'll see. But uh, I'll try to try to shoot a little bit more here tonight. Um, so there's at least some volume to to this video, um, but yeah, like I said, it's just been a really stressful day for me, um, making calls and you know all this other stuff. Um, I'm looking forward to in a week or so, or I think two weeks, uh, the 28th through the 31st. I'm going to Seattle for my uh, oldest cousin's wedding, which I'm really pumped for. Um, I love her dearly, and I really like her uh, her fiance, soon to be husband. Um, I'm uh, I'm really pumped to see my family again and. Just get out of lacrosse. It's been, uh, it's been, I think almost six months since I've left the state, and uh, I'm ready to uh, meander, meander out of here and just adventure a little bit more. I'm pretty big into traveling, uh, and uh, I don't know. It'll be nice to just, you know, go somewhere and escape and uh, relax. Uh, unfortunately, I can't take my girlfriend, but uh, you know, I'll miss her. But you know, it'll be good for me to get out and uh, see. And I'll definitely be taking you guys along, because um, why the hell not? So, I will uh, talk to you guys later. Well, hey guys. So, just got back from work. Um, sorry I didn't film down there much, but, uh, you know, when you're working, you're working. So, uh, yeah, I've been doing that. Um, I feel a little better. Work always actually kind of helps. I love my job. I'm uh, really into, like, being, kind of doing roadie work. Um, stage work, stuff like that. I've always been into that uh, ever since I was about mm, in sixth grade. I helped down at uh, UW Lacrosse um, or UWL uh, in the theater department. Um, I know the professors down there and uh, you know ever since then I was helping build stages and uh, build stages, do lights, do sound. Originally before I got into filmmaking I was like that when I was a kid too. 
but uh, I didn't actually do much of it, but I always loved the concept of it. Um, but, uh, what was I saying? I completely lost track of thought. Oh, there we go. Um, yeah, ever since I was that age, I, I've been to the theater and uh, got into it kind of more and more. And then finally I work, uh, worked uh, at my high school as the head uh, stage person. Uh, kind of both, kind of almost the head of the, uh, the department. Uh, we had a, a teacher that was kind of like temporary or new at it. So I kind of ran the whole, whole shebang, uh, built the stage uh, with his help, obviously, but uh, mainly kind of ran everything, made sure everything was in place, all that stuff. And he kind of focused more on the acting portion. And uh, I worked, I've worked, I want to say almost 14 or 15 plays down on UWL as a stagehand or helping build the stage or both or run sound or lights or you uh, stuff like that. Now I work down at the lacrosse center doing pretty much all of that, but for traveling shows and um, kind of more like, you know, um, you know, actually touring stuff. And uh, I think that's where I want to go at some point in my life is tour for a while, um, preferably probably with a band or something, but, uh, you know, that'd be fun. But, uh, yeah, I'd love to have you guys comment down, on the, down below, um, you know, what kind of, what, but yeah, things that I could show you behind the stage. Um, Definitely comment below and uh, tell me tell me what you're thinking. Uh, my camera just died, so I'm kind of playing the oh gosh, I hope it doesn't die again game. So um, I hope you guys have a great night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. And uh, please comment and like and subscribe. We'd love to hear from you guys, and you know what parts you're liking about this and what parts you're not. So I'll talk to you tomorrow.